The WWE is really playing up the Raw vs Smackdown aspect of Survivor Series this year. They really want us to believe these two brands hate each other and want to have supremacy. Of course, this leaves the door open for somebody to play the traitor and betray their own brand. Who will it be? Here's some possible Benedict Arnolds to keep an eye on. These two really need to be grouped together, and they are also the most obvious choices. Owens and Zayn have beef with Shane McMahon, Commissioner of SmackDown Live, and Captain of the Blue Brand Survivor Series team. They also aren't on SmackDown's team, due to losses to Shinsuke and Randy Orton. This leaves them with no role at Survivor Series at the moment. That definitely won't continue to be the case. It wouldn't be surprising in the slightest for Owens and Zayn to show up and ruin things for Shane and company. After all, it's Stephanie McMahon and Triple H who put the Universal title on Owens once upon a time. Another SmackDown Live competitor, Bobby Roode, has been working as a face since making the move from NXT. This is not the ideal role for the glorious one, as he works better as a pompous heel, and making that turn should be on WWE's to-do list. Survivor Series could be a really good time to do that. He doesn't need to leave the SmackDown brand afterwards, which will further solidify his role as a heel. The Miz may not be a fan of Daniel Bryan, but he sure as hell has got some beef with Kurt Angle, the GM and also the captain of the Red Brand Survivor Series team. He'll be busy defending his IC title at the pay-per-view, but that doesn't mean he can't shake things up later on. Or perhaps after he beats or loses to Baron Corbin, he can just take the Intercontinental title with him over to SmackDown. Whatever he does, he'll remain one of the best heels on the roster. Like Rude, Charlotte works better as a heel. She's been friendly with Becky and Naomi, but now that's time to change. Let her take out Lynch or Naomi. Heck, let her take out the whole SmackDown roster and declare that she doesn't need any friends and only wants the title. It would make SmackDown a bit heel heavy, but that can be fixed in the upcoming weeks. Roman Reigns has been dealing with an illness, but hopefully he will be back in time for Survivor Series. This would be an amazing time for the big dog to finally make a heel turn. The Shield just reunited. Angle just fought alongside Ambrose and Rollins at the last WWE pay-per-view. Imagine if Reigns turned on all of them. He'd immediately be the most hated guy in WWE. He'd be pretty perfect from a storytelling standpoint. And these are a few possible traders for this upcoming Survivor Series. I hope you're all having an amazing day. Thank you so much, as always, for watching Wrestling Hub, and I will see you later with more wrestling videos.